and that is absolutely critical for the country. Not one or two quarters. That's uh, no. I think mid three. This this latest quarter. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it, it, it's seasonally adjusted this quarter. But I think we absolutely can have sustained growth at that level. And to get there, our number one priority is tax reform. This will be the the largest tax change since Reagan. We've talked about this during the campaign. Wilbur and I have worked very closely together on the campaign. We're going to cut corporate taxes, which will bring huge amounts of jobs back to the United what States. What do you think you can get to on that? We're going to get to 15 percent, and we're going to bring a lot of cash back in, into the U.S. And Is it possible, Andrew, to get to 15? It may be. We had a couple of different guests on. We saw Kevin McCarthy yesterday uh, down in D.C. You think 25? You think we can't? No, get we had a guest on earlier in the morning who, a, 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 a Washington analyst who was suggesting they thought. That, we, they, that the conversation would start at 15 and potentially could creep up. I don't know where, where, where you, if you think well, that's you know, the I, possibility. I, I would first just say that corporate taxes are one component of, of revenues to the government, okay? And, and the main component is obviously personal income and personal taxes. So we think by cutting corporate taxes, we'll create huge economic growth and, and we'll have huge personal income. So the, the revenues will be offset on the other side. And we're going to have a big middle income tax cut. That's another <coughs> big part of this in simplifying taxes. Taxes are way too complicated and people spend way too much time worrying about ways to get them lower. Well, does, is dynamic scoring going to come back into uh, of, where of, people of, believe in it because people I, we have people on that just flat out on the left say there's no proof that it that it ever works I, I don't see how they can come up with that if you do four percent growth you get more tax well, of, do you of, not? of course it works and of course you have to have dynamic scoring it would make no sense otherwise and we're going to work with Congress and I think they understand that and dynamic scoring means that you you, when revenue. you cut taxes, some people believe that that changes behavior, which leads to more revenue. Right. The left has argued that there's no proof of that, supposedly. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.